Hey, Soviets and Soviets of the Red Army, how y'all doing? This is Con Ulrich. And I'm Wang Ru. Hello, hello, hello. And bring you another historical mission today. In, um, in this case, we are escaping from the breasts. Or breast, one or the other, depending on who you talk to. <laughs> uh, but, um, we, in fact, we're not escaping. We actually want to bury these guys in our breasts. We uh, want the breasts. Exactly. We need them. Exactly. We need them. But, uh, Rang, what do we have? Well, we are playing as two uh, guard rifle regiments. Our, our rifle regiments are pretty similar. Like, we barely have any tanks. We've got a lot of infantry spam. Khan's got some pretty nice SU 152, some rocket artillery, pretty light air power. It's really just going to be guard spam to, to victory. That's our plan of action. And we have a pretty good income spread. I get a little bit more in B phase and C phase. Khan is a little bit more A phase centric. And we're up against two camp groups. Uh, Fesmon and XXIII, which is also just 23rd. They're both German, just kind of like standard infantry units. Nothing really too crazy here, not many tanks, not much air power. Just, you know, grenadiers and some AT guns, etc. And probably some bunkers. Or actually, no, no bunkers, because the deployment zone's all around the corner, which is pretty interesting. Yeah, praise Ganesh for that one there. The removal mm -hmm. of, of obstacles. But, um,. Yeah, our air power, both for us and for them, is pretty weak. They have a couple of carpet bombs in B and C that we have to be concerned about, but other than that, it's pretty much going to be clear skies. Yeah, it's going to be a real uh, infantry slugfest, really. Um, you can see right now, the way that Rank's got himself all kind of set up, he does have this huge push over here on the left-hand side. He's going to go and try to scoot for Mokremi Novich. Uh, we have to watch out because you can see in the back there, the Germans do have themselves a land and air reinforcement right there, which we kind of missed in the first time around. Mm -hmm. um, me, in my particular case, uh, as you can see, I have two different columns here. One column is scooting for that town just to the south-ish of the middle BP. And I have another big, big group going for, well, the town further to the southeast of that. I have one lone rocket artillery. As you can see, that northernmost smoke point, we're going to hope that we can move up quick enough to reduce some of the spread, and we're going to try to nuke that crossroads. If nothing else, do some area denial as the Germans move in from that road right about there. Uh, that said, we have to be kind of cautious because the Germans take away uh, resource points from us if they control all three. So we got to get in there as soon as we can and uh, really take stuff down, you know? Yeah, yeah. Uh, but in the meantime, Rang, you all good to go? I'm pretty much good to go. All so, right. Uh, let's launch this battle into the stratosphere. Indeed. And, um, here we go. Here we uh, go. You can also see as a very early Studebaker here. Um, having the rocket artillery is going to be very good for us. Especially since I want to make sure we actually have ourselves. Um, well, yeah, I'm going to be pretty much easy into there. I'd be good. Mm -hmm. Yeah, hopefully it's a left-hand flank will be pretty easy to secure. I mean, they don't have an initial deployment now, so hopefully it's a pretty easy town capture and that should slow down our defeat, because we're going to lose pretty soon if we don't capture anything. Good news is, uh, objective support already, <laughs> so uh, we're fine. Mm -hmm. um, and as, Go for it, please. Yeah, that's a very long, like, minor defeat for the Germans. It's, uh, hopefully this doesn't go on for 50, 50 minutes and we can capture another flag or two. Well, I gotta rush my artillery strike a little sooner than I thought to get into that. Oh my god, they're gonna get there before I can get there. Opal Blitches are blitching in. Oh jeez. Launch! Launch, you jerk! Get out, get out now. Get, the, get, get into the houses, my boys. Go, go, go! Uh, you have four or five trucks moving east-west. So, um, you know, glass half full, we, we, we seized one town. Mm-hmm, that was pretty easy capture. I haven't actually seen any Germans over here yet, so maybe I can actually capture at respawn point, and that would just make life hella easy. That'd be great. Uh, unfortunately, my own strikes are just not going well. I'm coming out to respawn now. Enemy air contact already, that was fast. What, is it the Yonkers? Yeah, it's the uh, Yonkers ground attack. It is a Yonkers. Yonkers. Oh, dear oh, God. What a bunch of junk. Oh, no. no oh, no. no. Let me no, get some... No, no, no. 
Uh, oh, you dodged it. Just, whee. just like in the Matrix, man. That could have gone really bad. Yeah, I'm taking actually some pretty heavy fire. My PTRTs are pretty much all down already, but that's kind of to be expected. Um, yep. Not surprising. Oh, yay, yay. I that 152 in pretty early here. Um, let's see if I can actually get into some of the forests here. A lot of my guys are getting beat up kind of hardcore. We actually have a, cool, we have a Ganata VF. Oh my gosh, there's some crazy stuff going on here. Interesting. Oh yeah, I got some 50 men. Huh. That's, that's not fun to be on a receiving end of. No, it is not. In fact, I'm trying desperately to get after this Junkers with this lag of my own. So, uh, I don't think he's going to be able to get step into the attack on me. I think he's going to lose it pretty quickly. At least that's the idea. Dude, yeah, head gonna, to head, you got to be able to kill that. I'm going to try to get some stuff on this uh, ridge line to help you out. I appreciate that. So if we, yeah, if we just get like AT guns and support guns on there, we pretty much can just shoot down into the town. Easy peasy. That's good. Well, the, uh, we got the Junkers. One of the Junkers is down. I think he's got one more. Between your 410 and my stuff over here, we should be pretty well set. Wow, that 410's going to... Buy that farm pretty quickly. You have a 37 mil up, don't you? Yeah, I got two 37 mils up over here. Okie dokie. One die, you bastard. Dirty plane. Uh, yeah, you still have more troops moving east west. Uh, you're gonna have some guys in this town right here. I, I'm sending some infantry over here to uh, hopefully clear it up. So for the moment, I'm just holding a couple of compounds. Um, I'll start to shift in to cut off that support pretty quickly. I am also getting my artillerist in so we can get some line of sight on stuff. There's a lot of Ugrain over here. Hey, you're making pretty good. Rusty making pretty good progress into that town. But yeah, that's, that's okay. The 50 mils are gonna slow that down. It seems, and all, all the machine guns just rail. Yeah, let me get some mortars out to uh, support that. Yeah. Oh yeah, yeah. Uh, well, I can also just nuke the town too. Eh, forget it. Fall back, boys. Oh. I thought capturing this, uh, like, north and uh, what's it called, supply line would be easy, but uh, just, uh, they're really throwing in all the infantry over here. <laughs> uh, oh, wow. Yeah, yeah, I know. You're kidding. I'll be fine. I'm, I'm slowly breaking through. Guard DPs at Freestyle Veteran Chi are not to be trying for Drift. That's okay. Um, I have more infantry coming down my ridge line. There we go. Dude, the, the smart auto system is so it's it's so nice. And just being able to set artillery just to work by themselves logically is extremely useful. They have so much micro, so much micro. Ah, artillery. Mm hmm. King of battle, man. The 82 millimeter is just absolutely terrifying. Are you rocket? Uh, I'm just pounding that ridge line. And very soon, I think. Just, I think we're just going to have ourselves a sustained Automachiki rush. Very close to getting his spawn. Oh, my 
Yeah, I think I pretty much got the uh, top left spawn now. It's uh, it's been oh, secured, comrade. Comrade Khan. I feel like call me a comrade Khan is kind of a contradiction <laughs> in terms. <laughs> Yeah, it's a good alliteration, though, you got to admit. Oh, it totally is. Don't get me wrong. You think it's time to get some combat effectiveness in, the, in this in this fight? Yeah, yeah. I think you need more, some more avtos. Get a little bit cheeky in here. Yeah. Well, I'm gonna bring it to combat car. Might as well. Mhm. Mm oh, you got a commander. Do I have a commander? Uh, I tell you, I don't tell B-Face. I that much. Uh, I think we should be able to secure Malopa Gorda pretty soon. Yeah, I almost got this ridgeline over here, overlooking it. Now, we gotta be careful because they're gonna bring in some strokes pretty soon, so I'm trying to see if I can rush up some more PTRSs. Okay, I'm got my AT guns. See if I can set up some. Do you have AT guns? Not until B. Okay. I'll see if I can uh, set, I can drop, set one drop up. Drop your fire a little further to the west, please. Hey. Oh, yeah, stop firing. Objective concert, uh, secured. Here we go. Now we can see if we can capture the last run. Yeah, I think we will. I think we'll be fine. Mm -hmm. Yeah, we got 20 minutes. I mean, either way, we're, we're going to run it. Just... How do you want to approach this? We could either hit it down south or like try to like stretch our line eastward. Uh... You know what I'm going to do? I'll, I'll set up another force to kind of go after it. So I'll deploy a force. I'm gonna buy roads. more anti air. As I'm, I do not like the Luftwaffe and its ability to fly airplanes over my lines. Uh, oh, cluster bomb! I hit it your way. Oh boy! Dispatching. Right, so now I only have like one T60 Redev here. It's he 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 he's he's allowed to be clustered. He's an acceptable loss. Wow. Yep, you're a Soviet. <laughs> One lag. Uh, Later on, the Germans do get some fighters. Like, I got a. Uh, there's one of them right now, Fokkerwolf 180. And one of them also do have the new Fokkerwolf, the uh, D9, which is the, the really fast boy. Um. Uh... Well, he's going to be on my tail. I'm going to try to lean him over top here, anti-air, but I might lose him. Up and team, Khan. I'm trying. I will try. <laughs> try. <laughs> Do you want to focus, like, sending all your new forces, like, East, and I'll send all my forces now to Roger Town and try to hold it, and you do the fence. That would be fine. Whatever you would like to do. Awesome. For the moment, I am just pounding an area that does not need to be pounded. Taking him to Pound Town? Oh, you know it. I'm right. Actually, what I'm going to do brushes here. Oh, I guess you have mortars now. kind of forgot about that part. Hey! I'm proud of you. Well done, boys. I kind of feel bad going after ground pounders with um, anti-air, excuse me, with air power, but, yeah, whatever.
I still have 12 squads of infantry over here, so... <laughs> and I, I just can continue to buy just absurd amounts of them. Mm -hmm. This is always the thing about playing... I mean, in Soviet in general, you just have so much stuff. Yep. Especially in these, these campaigns, they just... They just unload it onto you. Like, as T-34 battalions, we have like 40 to like 60 T-34s and some. It's like, oh boy, I can't hold all these T-3485s. Again, I just, I have literally seven squads of PTRSs. I just feel like <laughs> I just, I just, you know what, to do this. I think for combined combined penetration power, they can probably one shot Stug just frontally. Our PTS they all shot at the same time. Out the sun. Yeah. <laughs> just volley fire. Well, it's that, just that's what's happening though. Mhm. Mm yeah. yeah, PTRS is uh, always fun to use. Like I have Studebaker who's got absolutely no um, ammunition left. Yep. Rang, I think we got this, buddy. Yeah, I think we got this. I don't have too much on... Oh, no, they got an AT gun shooting at you. Oh, darn. Oh, no. Look at him, it's like a pack 30 Oh, no, it's... Oh, it's a pack 40 Yeah, it's a pack 40 I'd like to point out the fact that literally, as of right now, I have just bought something like 12 <laughs> superiors. <laughs> and I, I think... Have, and there's still floating points. I think you need more superiors, cards. You know, I'm floating so many points too, I want to get in on the action. Let me send some units to help guard your shield. Well, now I have four squads of guards just kind of waltzing down the road. And I'm also going to bring up an off map over here, that's be pretty useful. Okay. That's good. <sighs> yeah, we just have overwhelming firepower over MGs. And we haven't really seen any thugs. I haven't noticed any. The thing is, again, like, I just feel like I just have an absurd amount of troops. It is an absurd amount of troops. Half-tracks go, half go boom. <laughs> oh, <laughs> oh, they, the is that the 50 cow things? Oh, God. It was all the sack. They have the bloody uh, 50 cow trucks. So that's, like, so much firepower of the superiors. An American armored group, yeah, for without the armor. At this point, I have 10 squads of other Machikis. I think it's going to move into the east and we'll come in behind. They do have, okay, they have a pretty good base of fire. Yeah, we, are, we are getting pinned down a little bit. Yeah, that's fine with the okay. Artillery. My off maps almost, yeah. Oh, yeah, and you got the, you got the 82s. Eh, I'll take some casualties, but not a big deal. Mm -hmm. They're Soviets, they're meant to get killed. <laughs> oh. Oh, I know it's always, like, hard in, like, SD2 to kind of get away from the whole Soviet, um, you, you know, like, Soviet, you know, just, like, land rush, just send all the guys memes. Because, you know, r realistically, it wasn't like that to such an extent. But this is... It really does feel like we're just doing human rave tactics here. Like we researched that in Hoi 4 and now we're just playing all the infantry divisions and slowly pushing our way through. Well, that's okay. Oh, yeah, it's, yeah, that was a pretty good rocket artillery strike. And I like how you got the flanking maneuver here of the Aftos. That's perfect. That's hey, goddamn yeah. perfect. Guards are getting destroyed. Big deal, it happens. Mm hmm. Death of one man is a, is a tragedy. <laughs> yeah. I know they got some armored cars out. Whatever so we do. Well, their entire group is now flanked. Mm -hmm. Any moment.
Got some, got some hammer and anvil stuff right here, man. I do what I can. I'm still eight minutes here. It's gonna be a. Uh, gonna be a bit faster. To countdown. Well, let's see. Let's. Uh, should I bring my one? Nah, I'm not gonna bring my one thing. Whatever. I'm just. I'm the real assault Tony should points. come. Wait, what? I think we had that backwards, my friend. What do you mean? It says, did you just get a pop-up that said the enemy has secured a foothold, another real attack? Oh, we, we lost the uh, right-hand flank just briefly, I'll try. Oh, okay. He was barely holding on to it without Jaeger. I was going to say, how dare they? I know. Inconsiderate. That Jaeger can go Jaeger somewhere else. Uh, I probably should get some more inventory in that town, shouldn't I? Yeah. You can never go wrong with more infantry. Yeah, probably not. There we go. We got it back under control. Yeah, was there really any doubt? No. No, not really. Not really. Now they're sending all the forces towards the middle, and we are just... Absolutely destroying him. Really, uh, that, that MLRS has been MVP of the match. Uh, I might be shelling you in a second. If I do, ah, that's really fine. That. Let's see. Well, I can bring in eight SU-152s now, so uh, might as well do that as well. There's four more. I hey, really like. Oh, in. yes, sir. Oh no! Oh, it's Stoke E. I'm, I'm looking at how my guards are moving up through the town, reverse smart order, and it's really goddamn smart. They actually move from building to building, like they oh, move from are one building. Using it? I, I yeah, should. I just didn't think about doing it. Like I'm watching them move up through this town, and they just jump in from building to building, and then they stop when they see something, and then it's shockingly, shockingly skillful. effective. Yeah, it's. Because usually I just like tell them to go to run it the other end of the town and they never get into the buildings, but... Still, the... I know I don't shut up about it, but god damn, the smart orders are really, really good. They've done a fantastic job with that, just completely removes a lot of the micro. Eh, fine, alright, at that point I'll just tell the eastern group just to seize. <laughs> just <laughs> yeah, see just select effort. I'm gonna do every. Yeah, I'm gonna do the same thing. Tell everyone to seize. Uh, to get to the enemy spawn point. Have my... Why are you not falling back? I can get planes now. Well, I have planes coming in to kind of just destroy some of that... The Stugs. I think I got the uh, first Fucker Wolf out now. I don't give a fuck. That's the spirit. Thankfully, I only have one. Suppressing. Okay. I think we're doing okay. Yeah, we're doing pretty good. <sighs> Oi, I think you, you almost got the fucker. I got at least one down. Yeah, he should be... Are you going to steal the kill from me at the last second? I say, do we have a Rick Tovin thing happening? Yes, we do. <laughs> we have to, I don't know if you got yeah or I got yeah. You, you got that. Everyone oh. told me. I'd be like, well done. You've killed the enemy. And I'd be like, okay, cool. But uh, no one said, oh. well done me, so therefore it must have been you. It's like playing arcade battle on Wolf Thunder. <laughs> Tank beats everything. Oh. And all the kill steals. Well, right now we have a stroke moving on the eastern side, and I. What do you just shellac? That was, an, that was an artillery gun, yeah, roughly. I don't know if he's here anymore, whether I shot him or whether he moved, but hopefully I hit something. Oh, okay, cool. 
Well, at this point, I have a bunch of um, infantry that's all around of a stroke. So, guys, I mean, look at this. I, it's like attack of the ants. <laughs> it's a very target-rich environment for that sunk. The autos go marching eight by eight. Hurrah! Hurrah! <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh! Three anti-tank grenades. You have them for a reason. I think at that point, all those guys could just run up to the stock and flip it over. Yeah, exactly. Be like a turtle on its back. Well, right now we we've we found the commandant. Let's the there commandant we go. die pretty quickly. Guys, that's the one you let out of whatever. Uh, some people just not professional. I know. There we go. The the command commandant the commandant's running, the commandant's running now. Yeah, well, in the meantime, all of my guys are running past this thing. <laughs> there we go. There we go. There we go. I had to force them to attack. Just zoom in and see this human rave is just fantastic. It is. It's lovely. It's so it's cool. This it's game looks great. Or it's already, it's already looked great. Let's see, where's the reinforcement point? Okay, I took with the other reinforcement point for them. Wait, we lost an objective? What? Rang! What? On your left. Oh, shit. You, you I done, away, I done... you away from the reinforcement point. Oh! Oh! Maybe I shouldn't have set those guys to attack. That was a dumb move. I should say so. I know. Let me just, let me fix this problem. Okay, let's just throw in like a few brigades here. Well, that, just... and that's the thing. I have 360 points right now, so you know what I'll do? Just, I have 16 more guards there. I'm in your way. Cool. We gotta give them a fighting chance. Uh, yeah, 14 squads of guards later. Oh. Oh my gosh, they're, they're swarming. They actually have a I ton of- they have uh, all of their tanks coming over that direction. I think that's because we knocked out the right-hand reinforcement lane, so now the- that's, that's the only choke point they can come through now. Oh boy, that's uh... Jeez, they're throwing- Everything in the kitchen sink down that route. Is ground fire coming up to me? Yeah, ground fire's coming up at me. Oh boy. Yeah, I'm gonna back away for it. Actually, one of the few like 20 mils that they have. Oh no, they got like a flag for Lynn truck here. I mean, we said there was a lot of infantry earlier, but Jesus Christ, that's a lot of that's a lot of sucks. Alright, well... I need my rocket artillery to start hitting... ...this intersection. Should be fine. Yeah, we only have, it's only a minute left. Hmm. We just have the convoy coming in. <laughs> it's, it literally extends from the reinforcement point all the way to the capture point. <laughs> Oh my god! <laughs> <laughs> it's a goddamn centipede! You have 33 automachikis? Oh no, 29 guards, 30. Oh jeez. The Studebaker centipede. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Oh Objective my security, yeah, we're fine. <laughs> okay, there we go. Yeah, okay, let's just. Let's, 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 let's get my artillery off in the meantime. There we go. Yeah, we're gonna, we're gonna run this very easily. It's just, just hold position, guys. You're good. This might be the best thing that's happened to us ever in this game, ring. <laughs> Better than losing five bomb and five tanks to the new single, new single run. <laughs> they just keep on coming. <laughs> I almost want to lose it, lose a point, just so that we can send this entire wave just to just slather them. But nope. There we go. Nope. Nope. Oh god, oh, that was uh, oh, that was fun. I, re -unlo I unlocked an ace. John Howard for the 6th Airborne. Have fun! Woo! That's, that's a bug, because 6th Airborne isn't even in the game. No, it is not. Uh, let's see. Hey, I actually did decently well. Same here. Wow, we barely... That was, that was pretty easy, I'm not gonna lie, but goddamn, that was fun. That was just fun. Indeed it was. Yeah. Oh my gosh, I take a quick look at my kills. Who was my biggest, uh... Wow.
Infantry's doing quite well. One, five, yeah, two. Got a few. What about my artillery? Did that guy do anything, really? I mean, don't get me wrong. Unless they did some, like, suppression, but... Well, if you look at... I have, um, one pack 40. Schwarzenberger was my... Just... He was my bane. One, two, three, four, five, six WC-52 dushkas. Set <laughs> eight. Eight of them. But, of course, I was running them constantly at him, too, so... Mm -hmm. eh, whatever. Oh, Rang, it's always fun. That's always fun. That was... I was, I was just fun, plain and simple. But all right, uh, I think there's one more that we have yet to do. Yeah, there's two more. Two more. Well, two more. Case, we should go haste into that. So, folks, thank you mm -hmm. so much, as always, for tuning in with us. Um, until next time, I'm Con Ulrich. Rangaroo, take it easy.